Well, I never thought this day would come. What up my dinky rats, it's me Dennis. I'm really embarrassed. I must say that right off the bat, I am really embarrassed. Because, let me explain. Let me explain. WAKE UP! Okay, wake up, dumb sh RAT! Okay, no more stalling, we're buying an s course today. But let me tell you something, let me tell you something. I can explain. Let me tell you something, let me tell you something. All right. Let me tell you something, let me tell you something. Wait, 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 wait. The other day I finished training my Appaloosa horse, which I bought in one of my last videos. And I went back in my home stable trying to look for a horse to train next. And then I realized I only have Arabians, Shire horses, Pasofinos, Paint horses. I'm tired of them. I've been on these horses for the past few months. I've been only training these horses. And um, I do have other horse breeds, I just don't want to train them. I don't know why, I don't want to. And then I hop on the Sanzlandic horse at level 2, and I hop on the rat, I go outside with the rat, I check the animations, and I'm like, wow, this little rodent right here, he might be looking like he got hit by a truck and somehow survived, but bro, the animations are pretty good. Anyway, dude, the scenery behind me here in Star Stable is just absolutely beautiful. Anyway, so I decided to buy one of the new... Icelandic horses, why do they look the same? This bug is kind of annoying. I really thought I hated the Icelandic horses just because... Can you shut up? I really thought I hated the Icelandic horses. That's mainly because of their manes. And I can tell you what I mean. Look at this. Look at the mane. What in the actual rat's nest is that? What is that? The BG wave things, like, oh my god, it's... Dude, it's so cringy. Like, it's every single hairstylist does that too. Like, every single one I look at, I'm like... Wait, like why? Like no one wants that, you know that, right? Like don't do that. Like oh my god, like don't do that. And then they take like the, like the, the straightener, right? And they do this. Like oh my god. Think outside the box of like what is pretty. Like do you think people in like France are doing beachy waves? Like it's not the vibe. Stop. Oh my god, like, I can't stand the beachy waves. It infuriates me. Like I'm going to literally like I'm gonna go with the scissor and like cut every beachy wave off. Like I hate beachy waves i hate it it's so tacky stop stop it right now stop and then if you try to shave the thing it looks freaking weird it was like a pig or something i don't know the horse just looks weird now and then the roached mane i'm not a fan of the roached mane it's not the worst but i think i'll have to go with it just because i cannot stand this wiry spiky weird ass mane I wish they would change the main. I don't know why. I wish. I just wished. I mean, I know why. It looks like ass. I just wish they would remake it. You know what I mean? It looks very weird. But yeah, I still have not decided which one I want to get out of these two. Just because. What is this main, bro? Just because this dude right here looks better with this main style. Like the horse overall looks way more. I don't know. I like it more in the face. This one, even if you do change the main style, something still looks off about it. And are you guys seeing that too? Wait a second. Wait a second. I've seen this bug on the other Icelandic horse. What is wrong with your eye, buddy? There's something in your eye, and it's bothering me. Do you see how there's this, like, light reflection, the blue one? It looks like the eye is made out of glass, almost. That just looks wrong and weird. Look at that. And then this one, too. Look at that. Oh, man, I'm gonna whoop your ass if you move your head again. Look at that. See that light flare there? It just makes it look like the eye is made out of glass. It looks very fake and weird. Anyway. So, I really like this horse, I really do. The coat is really cool, the mane again, ruining the horse, but the, the coat, the detail, the herring is absolutely insane. I feel like this one is a bit plain, but I like I like that about it. However, I like the, the coat of this one, it's really interesting and realistic, and just different from the rest of the coats that we have in the game as of right now. Someone help me out. Part of me just wants to buy this one, just because I haven't seen anyone in the game with it. Bro, I just... I just watched some videos to see which one I want to buy out of these two, and I need the break. Let me give you an impression of what I've just watched. All the videos. I'm not kidding you. All three videos, these were the people that, this is what they said. So this is the new coat. Yeah, pretty nice, I like it. So this is another new coat. Pretty nice, I like it. So this is a pretty uh, new coat. Pretty nice, I like it. And then this is the last coat that we got, and it's pretty nice, and I like it. And there's nothing wrong with liking something, dude, but if you're gonna say you like something, then say why you like it. And what really triggers me is how fake these people are. Like, they're just so... They're like a default skin from Fortnite, you know what I mean? There's no personality, there's nothing, they're like... Yeah, it's nice, I like it. Yeah, it's nice, I like it. Do you guys like me too because I like it? I, I, wanna, I wanna please you. Do you guys like me because I say I like these horses and I don't point out anything? Anyway, oh man, this is why I don't watch almost any Star Stable YouTubers. So I think I'll end up buying this one just because I've seen a video of this one song writing it and I've also seen the same person write this one and I feel like this one looks a bit better. We'll change the main 
I'm not gonna keep it like this just because I don't like the original mane. It looks very weird. The hairs look like they're just very like individual strands of hair, individual strands of hair. And they're very wiry and buggy and glitchy. Look at that. And you know why I really thought I hated these horses and why I'm embarrassed to even buy them? Because yes, in my video when I bought them, I only complained about the mane. I really did like the animations. But for some reason I forgot I liked them and I thought I really disliked them just because the mane situation stuck with me. And that's all I could think of when I would think of the Icelandic horses. And also about the fact that it's um, designed by the one that designed the Frisian horses, the new ones, which we all know how I feel about them. So yeah, and the same issue with the Frisian horses we have with this horse, the mane just looks very wiry and just very weird. So I'll be getting this one. I really do like the coat and the animations are pretty good. You guys know how I'm like with names. If it's not something funny, it ain't happen. You guys, I'm literally looking up on Reddit funny horse names because I want to name it something really funny. And then I see this, not mine, but Dennis's name is Arabian Ballist. You guys, I love you. That was so nice to see. All right, so I ended up with Wood Rising, original name. I looked for names, didn't find anything that I liked, so I came up with this one. I'm not explaining what it means. I think it just sounds very poetic, to say the least. So it's gonna be a youngster and it's gonna be a stallion. The bowls are staying. I'm just starting to feel really bad because I've literally circumcised, sorry, I literally cut my horse's bowls, all of them off. And it just, I'm starting to feel bad for them. Like they don't deserve this. They deserve some joy in their lives. Buying the horse, there we go, we did it. And I'm stupid again. I forgot to take the tack off. Now I have to send him the stable. I always forget about this update. It makes me so irritated. Why are they not freaking undressing my horse? Like, why do I have to do that? Um, why am I using these words to describe things? Like, my choice of words sometimes is just something else. No, but for real. There should be a button right now with tack for my current horse. I don't want to do it manually because I'm stupid and I forget. Also, I really love this horse. I found it in my stable and bro, it was looking like a freaking rodent. This is what I saw. Like, you're disgusting. Like, there's something wrong with you. And the moment I saw my horse looking like it's my stable, I was like about to mail Star Stable to delete my account. Because you cannot have an account and look like this. You cannot have a Star Stable account and have this horse in your stable. It's just, it should be illegal. But then I realized, wait, I would have never done that. I would have never bought this horse. Unless the magic coat, uh, sorry, the normal coat looks good. So then I saw this and I was like, okay, that makes sense. Then it's, you can still keep your account. You're, you're dismissed. You know what I mean? Okay, where is the horse that I just bought? Also guys, I have so many horses that I want to train. I mean, not really. The, literally the whole point, the whole reason why I even bought this horse was because I didn't want to train any of the horses that I have right now. Maybe Woody. But again, I've been just riding Arabian horses, Appaloosas, Shires, paint horses all the time. I'm just tired of it. And Pasofinos. Yeah, these are the horses that I had to choose from to start training. So it was Rising Boy, which I already started training. Um, this road, I don't know why it's here. Um, then there's Big Head. What the heck are these names? What does Big Head mean? Anyway, Batman. And then I literally scare myself. Do you guys see that? Like, I scare myself with the names that I pick. Like, I even forgot I named it that. And then what else? We had, oh, Wood Rising. Why did you, how did you even get here? It's because my stable is just empty. All right, so this is Wood Rising. I absolutely love this horse. I don't know why, I just do. And it's so weird because for the longest time I thought I hated the Icelandics. And I told you why. It's because they're made by the artist that ruined one of the most majestic horse breeds ever, which are the Frisian horses. I really don't like the way the Frisians look like. And I don't care what you think of it. If you like it, good for you. I'm not gonna judge you for that. Um, but I just hate it. Bro, this... So, a little story here. This is Jimmy. He's one of my best friends. This is Jimmy. He's a really good friend of mine. And you cannot befriend him because he's my friend. And he only wants to be my friend. No way. No freaking way I cannot... What am I supposed to do now, you rodent? It doesn't make any sense. Why am I allowed to equip the saddle from the set, but not the bridle? This is so idiotic. This is so stupid. They keep like releasing new horse breeds, but they don't even update the bridles for each breed. So that way we could equip it on all the horse breeds that we have in the game. And this is a generation three horse. Like it should be, we should be allowed to own it, to wear it, sorry. And yes, I do have all my horseshoes here and I'm not gonna get rid of them. I can't do it. I don't know why, I just can't do it. I really miss talking to you guys. I don't know why I really did. I really did miss um, just making videos. I really love the way the horse looks from behind when running, when galloping. Just the animations are so good and the jump is beautiful too. I really do like it, wow. Bro, I forgot the animations of these horses, I'm telling you. Like yesterday, I took my Icelandic out of my stable, the one that I already have, 
and I was like, bro, these animations are looking amazing. But the main is what really made me want to like never train them again or get on a landing ever again. And even the hard stop, you couldn't really see it there. But the animations, like, there's they're beautiful, dude. I love the animations so much. The rear is adorable. The horse looks very small, which, you know, I don't mind. It's a nice landing horse. That's how they are. And then the tolt, the special animation, special gait, looks really good. This horse is really well done. It's just the main that bothers me. That's it. Something about their hooves. They're so like they're so heavy, you know what I mean? Like the horse is so small, but the hooves are so heavy and like thick. This horse is absolutely beautiful. And why is this rabbit still here? They changed have you guys seen the new rabbit race? I absolutely love it. Look at this. They changed the rabbits and they look so good. Look at that. Since I'm level one, I'm just gonna press go and the shortcuts are not really gonna work because I'm a very low level, but we can still try and do them. It's funny how the rabbits just run in one place sometimes because they're supposed to be slower. So then you'll see some of them just run in, in the place, in place. Oh, I'm surprised the shortcuts are like going well for me since I'm level one. Like I'm surprised I'm still nailing it, nailing it. I did it. See how the rabbit was running in the same place? Anyway, I really do like the new, the new rabbit race now. It's really cool. So I'm going to be training this horse. Look at the, look at the forelock. Bro, there's so much detail in the forelock. Look at the way this one piece of strand this one piece of hair here just moves. So now it's all tied together, then it's separated, then when you trot, it becomes one again. But there's still some space in between. And when you canter, this strand of hair goes this way, goes to the left, and then when you when you gallop, it just starts flying all over the place, goes upwards, and then when you do this, when you run, you know, it's pretty cool. What I dislike about the main is the texture that they use and the fact that the the hairs are so they feel so separated and not like a hole sometimes. They just look like tentacles of an octopus. That's what I don't like about the main. The texture they use and all that. Pretty weird, pretty wiry and just abrasive. I don't know. Anyway, the horse is nice. You know, I'm really I feel bad for myself because I've just been stripping away the joy of riding these horses because I limited myself thinking that oh they look trash so I'm never gonna hop on any of sliding horse and so I took away the opportunity of me riding these horses because they look really good they look really cool and the jump is really cool I love them they're beautiful I have never done I've only done the Icelandic race like once in my entire life and I'm not feeling like doing it now so I'm not gonna go and do it but um I love these horses I really do Cannot wait to finish training this dude. Alright everyone, if you want to see more Star Simple videos or just horse content from me, then please subscribe. Please ring that bell, that's all I'm asking for. Don't even like the video, just freaking ring that bell and I will eventually kiss you on the lips if we ever meet. Alright guys, I'll see you in my next one. Peace out. Mm -hmm.